Yeah, one of Katherine Krause's new art pieces you can actually check out yourself. This is an image of it here. It's one of many hearts that's set to be displayed in the coming days around Kansas City. Now, Crown says despite the loss of her trailer, she's ready to get things replaced and get back to making art shows this spring. Each dab of paint. I like to work with a lot of texture. Each stroke of her brush. I like to work with a lot of vibrant color palettes. Catherine Krause sees the world differently. Sea turtles are actually my spirit animal. They're just so majestic and they're survivors. 12 years ago, the artist found out she was losing her sight. I like to paint how I see the world with my changing vision and a lot of that is Kansas City. She was diagnosed with Starsgard's disease. It makes light and dark look differently, and her peripheral vision is better than what's right in front of her. It was kind of scary to see those changes progress in a very short period of time. She can't drive and works as a full-time artist. Krause uses her trailer to show her art at festivals and conventions. One day, it just, it just wasn't there. She stores it across the street in a gated garage. Krause keeps a boot on the trailer and usually has it blocked, but one day it was gone. Sure, they were really disappointed when they opened it up and saw that it was just a bunch of tarps and tents. She says the loss of her trailer is a setback and a hard lesson. Thanks to family, friends and clients, she's making the money back for a new trailer and gear. And I am so touched by everyone who's been so generous. Police tell her she'll have to wait and see if it's ever found. And while it would be easy for her to get discouraged, that's not her style. Like for the next few months, I bet I paint 13, 14 hours a day. Coming out of the pandemic, I think that the potential for these spring shows could be incredible. Now there is a fund to help Krause get a new trailer and the gear that she lost. If you're interested in checking out her heart in person, it will soon be at the price chopper in Liberty before it's auctioned off for charity. Christelle.